The Psychotic Time Wasters present Whose League Is It Anyways? This season starring Playing Fetch With Your Graveyard It's PTW Bo. This is Kink Looks like we have a slowly approaching bear The bear will be in eventually Scratch that The bear will arrive sooner than thought Oh shit, bear is approaching At alarming speeds It's PTW G-Man Big number is big PTW is. Take what you can and give nothing back. It's Ace Dis Eternity. Oh my fucking god, it's a dinosaur with a vampire riding on its back. It's vinyl. Another plus one. Another plus, another plus, another plus, another plus, another plus, another plus, another plus one. It's PTW King. Hakuna Matata. It's PTW Dust. What's up, Internet, and welcome into Whose League Is It Anyways? The best Commander League game show on the internet where everything is made up in the points are the only thing that matters. I'm your host, PTW King, and you might be thinking to yourself, King, why is it just your face uh, talking to us and not the field of, of play that usually we see at the start of every league match? And that's because for whatever reason... Uh, not exactly sure what happened, but my audio did not come through during that broadcast, and uh, we didn't realize it until afterwards, so here I am doing the intro again. In this match, we have PTW G-Man, Aestis Attorney, PTW Vo, and Wizards Lizards. How's everybody doing? Pretty good, pretty good. Um, oh, all right. Excellent. Well, if you're new around here, who's lead is anyways? Uh, best Command League game show on the internet. We build decks to restrictions every season. This season is the March of the Machines and Commanders. Yes, the ones that are, you know, legendary and legendary. But that's enough about the rules. Let's kick it on over to PTW Vo for the points. Vo, how are we looking going into uh, Season 8, Match 6? Who's leaves it anyways? What we do, we got Daff out in front with 32, followed up by Wiz with 31 and a half. Then we got Kink with 30, Vo with 28, Aestis with 26, Vinyl with 23. Coming up the rear, it's G-Man with 21. I'm the greatest. I call him the caboose. <laughs> good check it. Excellent. Well, I believe everybody's got their sevens. Does anyone have any pregame? As it turns out. I do have free game. Stop. Because my opening hand contains oh. this card. Oh, Stop. God, is it Leyline? I'm going to yeah, play this no Leyline of Anticipation. Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. It's okay, oh. maybe we'll go to a plane that gives it to the rest of us. Everybody get him. Get me, no. He's Why? cheating. Get him. <laughs> That's what the card says, man. I didn't do it. <laughs> this is my day. 5% of the time, it works every time. <clears throat> Very well. I will draw me a card. I will then play this here Darksteel Citadel as land for turn. And let's go on ahead and roll that die. That's a two. I will tap this Darksteel Citadel to roll it again. That's a three. That's my turn. I'm going to draw. I'm going to play a swamp, and I'm going to do a pretty similar turn. Let's roll that die. Oh, that's a six. Let's planeswalk. Where are we going? All right, buddy, buddy. We got whenever you creature deal combat damage, you rampant growth. Oh, my God. Uh, sources deal double damage. Creatures no, have plus you. one, plus one in haste. No, thank you. And life gain. Let's go diagonal left, bottom. Boom. Players play the top card of the library revealed. You may play the top card of any player's library. <laughs> what the hell? I don't like this. It's a forest. Okay, you can play the top card of any player's library. That includes lands. Yeah. I have a Zorn. I'm going to tap and <laughs> roll the dot. <laughs> <laughs> Two. Past turn. What have you done to us? Wee! Draw, <laughs> reveal top card, rich cards, expertise. <laughs> Man, it's a bunch of expensive cards on top of these. Or it's orange, pretty Ben Horn Elves, and let's try to get the fuck out of here. <sighs> Six. Hey. All right. A life gain. Haste. Give your creature a, a vigilance counter. menace or trample counter. And Sanctum of Sarah, when you planes walk away from here, destroy all non-land permanent. Haste. Haste. <laughs> Boomsy haste. Hey, I'm going to get first blood by swinging Ooh. at haste. We got the one. big brain. Oh, my lord. Two. One. Damage. I will remember this. <laughs> Let's roll first. No. We'll do a temple scry. Um, leave it on top. Pass it. Let's go play a seat of the synod as land for turn. Roll the die one time. Got a five. Tap and roll it again. 
It's a three. I have nothing else to do, so I'll pass turn. I will draw. I will play a forest. I will roll the planes lot. I will roll everyone. That's a six. Everybody's going nuts. Okay. Well, we've got the plane we started on, the reveal the top plane. We've got uh, war storm surge the plane and My we've got mind, dude. all creatures are black and have death touch and one random door take me down the random door please bam reverse the game's turn order oh my Ooh. god sorry g-man Ooh. get time Ooh. walked bit. all right so how we're gonna handle this is we're going to swap g-man and Aces's position so that we can uh, go around the thing all right, all right. Well, I'm gonna and we land you. on um nar isle oh nar isle everybody loves nar isle i'm gonna play a fractured power stone and i'm gonna tap it for mana. Big brain. Look at the brain on brain. Oh, die. That's a four, and that's going to be it for me. All right, go ahead and tap. Draw. Pick one damage. Take a stupid point of damage. <laughs> Let's play a forest. Let's tap three. I basically gave the flash player an extra turn, and I don't know. <laughs> roll this die. That's a three. I'll pass turn. Untap. Take two damage. <laughs> Mountain. Two for fractured power stone. Roll. Planeswalk. Emerstern. I'm going to go to Nefalia. Beginning of your instep, mill seven, and returning a random card from your graveyard to your hand. I'm going to pay one to roll again and hopefully not get anything up. Chaos right now would be really <laughs> sad, too. <laughs> Uh, go to end step. Three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, pick a number one through seven. Three. Three. That's what'll come back. It is Icker Elixir. Oh, that's a great card. Mill three land, a board wipe, a big creature. And so just double checking, you spent one mana for the one and six chance to leave the place you wanted to be just to get that much closer well, to the point. you all had like two planeswalks already so I gotta do something. <laughs> You're a mad lad. Untap. Draw. Forest. I'm gonna pay three for Shaman of the Forgotten Ways. I'm gonna try to plan. And drop my dice on the floor while trying to roll. Perfect. That's a one. You do nothing. Congratulations. Then I will pass my turn. Mill seven. You get a random card back out of it. Five, seven. I'll pick seven. So whatever the top card of that pile is, you can get the top card of the pile. So yeah, that would be the last thing that got milled. Terrasmaton yeah. goes to your hand. That's a cool card. And then I will pass turn. Untap and draw. I will play a swamp. Tap four to cast an Icker Elixir. You know it. You love it. Oof. I'm gonna do my free roll. I got a chaos. <laughs> Nothing. Uh, I'll tap one. Roll again. I got a planes block. All right. We got deal damage. Um, players skip their untaps. Yeah, that one. Whenever a non token creature enters the battlefield, you search for a land. And when you planes walk away from here, reanimate all creatures. Um, how do I get the furthest away from that one? Bottom, <laughs> bottom right. Bottom right. Oh, God. Come on, guy. Oh, my <laughs> fucking God. For fuck's sake, man. All right. Fuck me, I guess. Okay, it's set up. Before that goes off, that means three. And I'll use that to play a Academy Manufacturer. Bring my total permanence up to five. Hey, you're shuffling away the flash, so that's nice. I don't think that's nice. Thing. I don't think it's nice at all. Simon's a psycho, okay? He keeps going into the abyss. I don't know. I got four lands and a beast within. A lunus, the cryptozoologist, a blinding fog, an unexpected windfall, Angrath's marauders, and an ingenious artillerist. Well, he got no land, but he got some good stuff. I got stuff. No land. <laughs> hmm. Do I scope for one <laughs> land? <laughs> Let's see what G-Man gets. Maybe I'll get lucky. All right, top four. And a natural growth. Core call. Woof. That should be fine. <laughs> and giant uh, add a fade. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> What well... did you do to us? <laughs> also, where we landed after the phenomenon is you have to flip a coin when you cast your spells to see if they get countered. Fuck. <laughs> oh. Thanks, wizard. <laughs> What are the places near here? Oh, sh um, players get their untap. Creatures get minus five, minus O. non tone creatures entering gets you a land, and everything in your hand has suspend. Mm. So, what's the suspend one do? Um, you can suspend them. Uh, I think it costs no mana, but they have s suspend X where X is the CMC. X this fucking sucks. Um, I'm gonna use the floating colorless to cast Path of the Schemer. Each player mills two. Cards. Flip a coin. Flip a fucking coin. 
Uh, odds is countered, evens is not. Three, it's countered. Great. Good. Great. <laughs> I didn't want to play a card anyway. Last turn. Cool. What a, what a turn, Wiz. What a turn. Let's draw a card. Hope it's a land. What a it's turn. not. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and crack my expanse and in response crack my scope. Because I do want this. I hate this. <laughs> Jesus. Lord. I just wanted the double striking dragon. All right. Well, let's roll to see if I can get out the plane. There's nothing else to do. Please, God. Chaos. So you can have target player reveal the top card of their library, and it's an online card. You may cast it without paying its mana cost, but you do have to still flip the coin yourselves. Wait, let's see what you got there, Mr. Gitterman. Uh, inspiring call. Draw a card for each creature you control with a plus one, plus one counter on it. Those creatures gain indestructible. Dang, does not dang. Does absolutely nothing. Well, you can cast it and have it be countered and send it to the graveyard rather than it staying on top of the library. That's um, true. Let's cast it. Let's see what happens. Odd is countered, even is not. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Damn. Cool. Rats. Last turn. Well, let's see if it's countered, I guess. We're going to attempt to cast Warp the Adiphage. No! So, evens, I get it. Odd is countered. Odds, there you go. Untapped row. I hate Woo! I hate this. I hate this. Uh, free roll. Not planes. Well, I gotta play into it. Um, cash to Hada. Means I get it. Odds I don't. But hive. Good. Perfect. Um, I'm gonna pass. Man, this, this plane is, is really is racking up the awful. interact points. This game is awful. Untap. Draw. We're gonna go ahead and go to combat. I'll swing Gorkwell at Wiz and Giant Edifage at Bo. So whoopee do damage. It. So eight sixteen because of unnatural growth. Okay. Well. And I take ten. Yep. And I get a copy of Giant Manifage, and I'm, I'm going to try to roll off this one. All right. Let's see if we can get off this plane. Two. Nope. <sighs> Pay one. Five. Nope. I tried. Pass the turn. I've never okay. seen a game go from so great to so terrible so fast. <sighs> yeah. Free roll. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a six. Well, that's one problem solved at least. Untap step creatures to spin and let's do the ramp one. Both. Whenever a non-token creature enters the battlefield, its controller may search for a basic and put it into play tapped. I'm gonna tap three and I'm gonna cast a far haven elf. <laughs> wow. Look at him go. Then I will pay one and roll that die. I mean, maybe I should use a different die because that's <laughs> plain well. We got mill, counter spells, creatures have vigilance, and uh, jund creatures have devour five. Oh my god. And one random random, random door. door. Random door. Random door. All lands are yeah. rainbow ones. Nah, oh, fuck. All right, I tried. Pass. Yeah, All right. It could have been. Uh, free roll. Let's see what happens. One. Reveal the top three cards of your library. Put all land revealed this way into your hand. The rest on the bottom. Okay. Land. 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 Ooh, Is land. land. Badalkin Humiliator and an Island. You know what? I'll take lands. Land. I do get two lands. And the rest go on the bottom in any order. Let's play an island for turn. And I can roll again. Three! Uh, I now have eight cards. I gotta discard something. <laughs> and I'll go ahead and pass turn. Gyre Sanitarius. Somewhere, maybe. It's four for Icar Elixir. Let's roll the free roll. Plane. Yay! Um, prevent all damage dealt creatures. Planes all control. Non token creatures get copied. No, not that. You don't like that one? Um, <laughs> we're gonna go random away from the Isle of Soup. Bant, your tab is out. Cool. What's okay. exalted again? Um, if your creature attacks by itself, plus one creature. Ooh. Um, uh, pay one roll. Not to pay two roll. Plane. Uh, what we got now? Camp block, cry four. Uh, what gets rid of bugs? Go away from the camp block. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever player taps a land for mana, it's one damage. Oh, okay. Just roll a bunch of chaoses. Um, and I will pass. <sighs> um, tap, draw, mirrored landscape. Go to combat. No, surely not. Swing giant adiphage and giant adiphage. Original adiphage at Wiz and token adiphage at Aestus. Damn it. <laughs> 14 going at both of y'all. Yep. All right, well, I'll get rid of mine, I guess. I'll block with Angrath and Marauder and the ingenious artillery to deal 15 points of damage at a mitigate five so i take nine let's try to plan to walk Ugh. nope pay one try it again 
Planeswalk. Your opponent stuff is fogged on your turn. Scry 4, upkeep mill 10, and whenever a creature dies, distribute power essers. Hmm. God, I like a lot of those. I know. <laughs> um, let's go with the fog. Western cloud. And then I will pass turn. I'm tapping draw. I'm going to roll. I'm going to tap one and suspend a search for tomorrow. I don't think I'll even get there, but I will cast my commander so I don't lose those points again. Pass turn. All right. Got to draw. Oh, nothing to do with the roll, so let's roll. Two, tap, roll. Four, nothing. Pass. On tap draw. Let's pre roll. Planes not ran. Nowhere is safe. No okay. phenomenons. Well, yeah. go here, I guess. I make a shape stir. We're gonna roll with Just take the planes while we're going to the grand yep. ocean. When a creature dies, you distribute its power as plus one counters. Chaos is each player exiles all creatures they control and makes a bunch of Hey! Um, so at least we <laughs> get rid of the bugs, maybe. You gonna roll again? Um, actually, what we're gonna do what? is three, four, five. I'm gonna cast Path Pyromance. Okay. So I'm gonna discard my hand make four red and draw five cards and then we will vote to either have chaos or planeswalk <laughs> i vote for chaos hey, I, I like chaos too i also want to vote for chaos One, oh two, guitar man we don't really care what you think so, <laughs> we're gonna exile all creatures and uh, you get one ones equal to the amount of power that i gotta exile. put yargle in my graveyard our hero pass the turn and I ended up with worse. I guess at least the bugs are gone. <laughs> I'm set up. Draw. Free roll. Nice pay to crack mirrored landscape. I feel like the top left, bottom right corners of this board are getting all the planes walk. I'm going to say there's a conspiracy. Icar Elixir is a card. I will swing uh, eight of the 1-1 one, one Sapperlings in Wizard's direction. Well, I'm going to block your eight two twos with 16 one ones and they'll trade all right sounds cool pass the turn. how many do you have left 10 yep. so okay. the the uh, other part of the plane triggers where when the creatures die you put their counters on to uh, other oh yeah um, how about that so g-man gets 16 plus one counters and uh wizard gets six plus one counters untap and drop some other Take a counter off of my suspend. I'll do my free roll. Five. I'll tap two. Cast Sakura Tribelder. Sack it. Put a counter on my dude. Stay. Go get a forest. And tap one to roll again. Get a four and pass my turn. All right, let's draw a card. Free roll. Let's go. Planes walk. All right, what do we got? All right, we got uh, tapping lands hurts you. We got making two through shapeshifters. We got make a random player discard a card. We got doubling season plane. Doubling season the plane sounds pretty terrible right now. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds perfect. What are you talking about? And yeah, one say. unknown door. Unknown door. Unknown door. Unknown <laughs> Let's door. take the door <laughs> to the unknown. The the unknown! Unknown! At the beginning of your upkeep, sacrifice a non-black creature. All right. That's another one. All right. Cool. Oh. Unknown door. Unknown door. Unknown door. Unknown door. <laughs> uh, the, we got uh, the discard, doubling season, artifacts become vehicles, and your in step mill seven and return a card to you. Know, three unknown. Unknown door. Unknown door. Unknown door. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I desperately need some land here. It couldn't possibly get worse, right? Yeah. It absolutely nice. can get worse. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> That's the one thing about playing chase I've learned. It can always get worse. <laughs> well, actually, I do need to get about as far away from the doubling season as I can, so bottom left on the door, let's go. Creatures have plus one, plus oh, one. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, fuck. Roll again. Roll again. How did we get back here? It was over uh, there. Well, I don't have anything else to do, so I guess I'll figure out a card to discard and pass turn. Let's go six for Croaks, uh, equal the rose. Uh, B, side one. Fine. Bring back the sepulchral primordial. Fucking okay. <laughs> Show me what you got. You got Steve, Farhaven Elf, and my commander. Your commander's in the graveyard? There is. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I'll take one of those. Yeah, sure. G Man, what you got? In my graveyard? <laughs> yeah. Impervious Great Worm, Verdant Sun's <laughs> Avatar. Shamanic revelation. That worm is sick. We're gonna get her. And I'm taking Angras Marauders from um this. Yeah, I figured that fucking yeah. much. I get six from Bird and Sun. I get five from Angras Marauders. I get seven Yargle Tani. Well, that felt good. Let's go to combat. And I'm gonna go Primordial at and 
Monkey Man, don't you dare block that. I hate six double shot. Ow. Says the man swinging with double power bugs all game. Main two, uh, free roll. Nothing. Come on, chaos. <laughs> gotta pay one and <laughs> roll. Nothing. We're gonna pay one roll. Sometimes you get nothing, guys. And I'm gonna pass. But hey, that's probably worth points at the end of the game. <laughs> Untap. Draw. So turn sevens. Go nuts. Forest. Five. We're going to pay three for Slumber Wild Sage. And we're going to tap Slumber Wild Sage for eternal witness to get back impervious grape worm to my hand worm and then i will uh, go to combat i'll swing one of the ten tens at aces eight of the two two saplings over at whiz so Aces is 20 go 120 power at him and you have a lot come 32 power coming at you whiz now i'm dead Walk through my sapling at the thing that it can block save me save me Let's see. Nope. Pay one. Nope. And then I will pass turn. Cool. Draw. Not a land. Roll. Woo one. Oh, I get another combat for the no creatures I have. <laughs> Can I get irony points? Irony. <laughs> Tap one. Roll again. Four. All right. Well, I'm a discard and pass turn. Oh, baby. Untap. Don't kill me without casting my commander, please. Oop, well, you should have got that done. I'm gonna play Molt for me. When you can play opponent gain control, take your big sapling. Mm. The tapped one, right? The untapped. Okay. Joke's on you. I have no creatures. Five, five. Go to combat. Arm full. Send it. And man. And the croaks hack. Zile five. Bring back blast furnace. Hell to double strike. GG. He gets blast, son. Planeswalk to Valia. Temple. Subscribe. Bottom. Go to the end. Step. Five, six, six, six. I'm mill seven, one, seven. And one through nine. Uh, four. Back. Uh, I guess one last feeble attempt to get some points before the inevitability of the end. Draw, roll it. One. Okay. I would love for there to be a land in my graveyard, but there is not. Let's grab a Lunas Cryptozoologist. Why not? <laughs> Tap an island. Roll. One again. Uh, I'm gonna pull a reverse engineer to my hand. Untap, draw, combat. Yeah, that's it. I throw my island at you in hopes of murdering you. Oh. Hey, man, it's a whole island. If I can lift up and yeet a whole island at you, that could be pretty dangerous. Let's get those stats. G uh, Ace is stats. All right, well, I managed to planeswalk twice. My mana tax is a uh, paltry five. I got three chaos, and that's about it. I got five plane chase, one chaos, and I spent five. Four planar tax, two planeswalk, one chaos. All right, let's go to the voting. Starting with Ace for the splashiest. Uh... Can I say plays walk into the chaos realm that completely rebooted the board as a play? I can say that the original category was going to be the had to be in plane. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> well, that. That was me. That was me. They <laughs> <laughs> fucked everything up. <laughs> you did. Magnificently. Get, get rewarded. <laughs> <laughs> this is a backward system that we have here. Um, I guess I'll put the second point on that path to get rid of that giant Adiphage was actually pretty nifty, so I'll give the second point to Bo. Better get countered. <sighs> Uh, whiz. Splashiest. I think the splashiest play was probably the path of the pyromancer. No, it wasn't. <laughs> it was the, uh, the fucking card that gets splashiest play every game. The Nephilim. Primordial. Primordial, yeah. yeah he's a pretty sick boy. Primordial was yucky. Splashiest play. I'm gonna go the rolling into haste with the Findhorn Helves. <laughs> <laughs> That's a me. You really fucked the entire game up in one turn, but <laughs> I should at least get points for it, right? You fucking rolled us into the double out of phage and then countered your own spell. <laughs> fuck game in one turn. You know, um, I, I came to play. <laughs> yeah, I'll get I'll give the fuck up uh to Wiz. I humbly accept those points. The uh Angrath thing for Vo. Getting splashy points with my cards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give uh three to having pregame, and I'm gonna give uh two to um the out of page stuff. Best theme. Sorry. Best theme. Waiver failed by Mo. He was not dead. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, real, real shortage of being dead from the dead lord over there. You see how many things I pulled out of the grave? He, a, a couple, a couple. And I sent the bugs to hell. You did send the bugs to hell like that. All right, so first points to Vos, second points to Guitar Man, I suppose. Woo! That worked for me. Got a buzz. I am giving the theme points to Aestus for playing pirates that then betrayed him. <laughs> You know what? I like that. It's a mutiny. I like that, that. That felt very flavorful to me. Like all he's got is these pirates, and they're like, "Oh, you don't have any resources." Well, mutiny. Oh, Good luck then. No, I dig it. Thank you. Um, and then I'll give points to Guitar Man for uh, playing a big green stompy deck and having no lands and still getting big green stompy. Well done. I actually love your reasoning behind Asus's point. <laughs> so he's going to get the uh, the two points. <laughs> and uh, Chipo did reanimate some stuff. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, Nobody's whatever. impressed. <laughs> But before. Uh, Wiz also didn't really get to show off his Vorthos, uh, so I guess I'll give it a vote. I think Wiz perfectly showed his Vorthos, which is big number, nothing else matter. Yeah, I'll give my two to Wiz. We got a bug. And I'll take us to the most valuable card assignment. I'm gonna, I'm gonna award this in memoriam <laughs> to the removal spell that never was. <laughs> Death Sprout. <laughs> <laughs> Wizard, I will give the most valuable card to you for I wanted to save us so bad. I know. You tried. And that was, <laughs> that, that was I saw the shining MVP points on it. It just didn't happen. <laughs> I don't care. I see it anyway. And I'm gonna give you credit for it. <laughs> because you man. had a plan. Um second most valuable uh, I hate to say it, but that's stupid out of page, man. Jesus. Bug. <laughs> I struggle to call this backup points because both of these cards earned the same amount of value for the exact same reasons. Unnatural Growth and Path of the Pyromancer. I think value-wise, like what you got for the card, I think Adaphage has to win because you didn't even pay mana for it. <laughs> Just got it randomly in exchange for a land um, <laughs> and nearly won the game for it. So most value there for sure. But the Path of the Pyromancer was a beautiful play. It was also splashy, but I didn't want to vote for it in two point categories. Uh, MVP. Uh, uh, the two for Wizard's spell that never was and the one for Vote's spell that never was. Oh. Yeah, really. <laughs> Chaos Warp. Two. In the morning for the spells that should have been. <laughs> well, I have three men and I have a chaos orb. Well, I guess we let her rip. <laughs> I, like, I like an in memoriam for a season with a lot of interaction. <laughs> <laughs> You get a slideshow for them spells that never were throughout the season. The In unfortunate angel. <laughs> I think we're gonna go to Angrats. Mm -hmm. They killed a bug and then also won me the game. Good. Mm -hmm. and I'm glad and we're voting for your own card. <laughs> He's voting for Asus's card. And uh then I want to go What? Icar Elixir. Oh, yeah. That's the, the only reason away. that horrible thing happened. <laughs> Where does that put us, Vo? For this game. Yeah, coming up rear. No, you love it, man. 13. What? What? Uh, third place. Ace is fourth. That man is not getting last. <laughs> not last. Woo! Uh, second place. Knight's going to And low scoring game. Yeah. Brutal. Uh, except me, Vo. First you fuck off. With <laughs> 31. Last oh, my score. fucking God. The fucking fix is in. <laughs> the fix is in. The showrunners always win, fellas. Well, and you're man. tabulating all of our votes, right? <laughs> We're getting <laughs> pencil whipped over here, man. I'm going to make an addendum, Mr. Wizard. Stop going to the chaos door! <laughs> never. Ooh, anything could be behind that door. I will never. It could be a boat. 
All right. Yep, yep, yep. So we're still at first. We got Daff with 32. Still at second. Kink. Oh, no. I think this is a shift up in second. Kink with 30. We got a dead tie on third. Bo at 28 quarter. Can live with that. We got Aestis at fifth, 22, and followed up by Vinyl at seventh, or uh, sixth, 22 and a half. G-Man coming up 20. Like this video and subscribe to the PTW YouTube channel to see more content and to find out when our new videos release. Follow the PTW Twitch channel and subscribe for ad-free viewing. Don't forget to follow that Facebook and that Twitter to keep up with all the good news. Be sure to follow us on TikTok and also don't forget to check out the new merch store. Best way to support the PTW crew and get cool shit at the same time. Thank you all for watching. Peace. Oil foil, Elish mommy.